Welcome to another video from explainingcomputers.com. This time I'm going to return to one of my favourite subjects in the world, which is computer storage, and I'm going to show you uh, some of the things I'm uh, currently using to make my long-term and off-site media backups. Right, or well, here we have some uh, StarTech two and a half inch drive cases. I love the way on the bag they write a hard to find made easy. That's certainly the case. These are a product that all sorts should exist. Took me ages to find them. If we look inside, if we can get in the bag here. You can find, let's get a few out. They don't want to come out. They're hidden forever. Come on. We'll have all three, I think. Why not? A whole lot. There we are. Here's the StarTech cases. Um, they're basically an anti-static plastic box which fits a, a two and a half inch hard drive. And they come, of course, with a label as well. And they come in this uh, black variety like, like this. They also come in a blue variety like, like, like this one, which is a sort of translucent. Not, don't like quite, quite as much, but uh, I do think, find these an amazingly useful product. I went to show one of these to a friend of mine and I said, look at this, this is one of the most exciting things in the world and he said oh what what drive have you got in there i said no just just the box is the most exciting thing in the world and he didn't really believe me and of course these are only any use to you if you've got two and a half inch drives to store inside them so let's get a hold of a two and a half inch drive push those out of the way here we have a uh, two and a half inch drive this is the drive i'm using at the moment in all of my archives it is i think the best value quality two and a half inch drive on the market. It's a Western Digital Scorpio Blue. This is a 750 gigabyte drive. So let's get inside. This is how it comes packaged up nice and uh, uh, securely. This is an Amazon. Does anything not come from Amazon these days? Lots of things seem to. We just get in there if I can get in. There we are. Um, and inside here you will find our Western Digital drive. Nicely packed we get it out of the box. It's got these uh, plasticated things around the edge. And you can see we have our drive in the middle there. There it is. And uh, always tricky showing you drives because they're all so reflective on the plastic. But if we open up, there we are at the top. The thing will come out eventually. Here we are. And there we are. I do like hard drives, as you know. This is a what, 750 gig. Western Digital Drive. And if we get back one of our um, StarTech cases there, as you can see, oh, it must be a different one. Oh, get off there. We can put in our drive like that. They go in that way up and close it up. That is my standard archive cartridge. And the great thing about this is you can either open up the thing and take out your drive to, to use it or at the top here, there's a little box, look, a little window. You can open up that window and you can plug into that your SATA cables. Maybe you can see better that way around. If I take a SATA uh, power cable connected in uh, there and a SATA data cable connects in the right way around there. So you can actually use this in the box to uh, make a, an archive or something like that. So, this is a simple video showing you my uh, favourite products at the moment for um, archiving and storing a lot of data off-site in these little um, StarTech boxes. A couple of decades or so ago, my uh, media archives looked uh, mostly like this. These are uh, reels of uh, 16 millimeter film and the negatives in, in these cans. And then on top there's what's called SEPMAG, which is a 16 millimeter film, but in a uh, um, magnetic tape variant. And this is run independently and then it's synced up to the, to the film here. Um, it's very different to the archives we have today. Um, after my archives looked like this, they looked uh, more like this. These are uh, pneumatic videotapes, very commonly used in the, uh, the media industry. And then in time, my archives look more like this. These are um, professional um, DV cam tapes. And it's perhaps because uh, DV cam tapes look uh, rather like these lovely little boxes from StarTech for storing uh, uh, two and a half inch drives that I happen to like these things 
so much. Anyway, that's the end of me wittering on about storage and archive and things like that, and I hope to talk to you again very soon.